What is up guys? It's Sam. Welcome back to my channel or welcome if you're new. Today we're tackling the ignorance of straw flower cacti. These are the tools you're going to need. Some scissors. This is an elf fan brush I got at the Dollar Tree and cuticle trimmers. I just use them for things like this. Give this video a like if you were unaware that cactuses bloom their own flowers and there's really no need to have these be glued on, especially at any store. So the first one we have is a bunny ears. This thing hurt so bad. This is a toothpick cactus. This stabbed me pretty good. So it's literally directly glued right on top. So I take cuticle trimmers and I'm actually having to cut right around the bottom of where the glue meets the cactus and this kind of just allows me to pull the straw flower right off the top. If you grab it in one go, if you're lucky, it'll just come off clean. Don't be distracted if you pull these little pieces off. They're called glow kids. They'll replace themselves usually within a month or two. Just keep your cactus in a warm sunny spot and they'll do well and regenerate themselves. Obviously don't overwater them. Same ordeal with this one. Um, this one didn't want to come up as easily. It was glued down a little bit more. Pretty sure I went with regular scissors on this. Ugh, look at that. Did you guys see that? Alright, so after a good fiddling around with it, I did get it to come off in one piece. <laughs> This one is a Domino's cactus. I was so, so excited to grab this guy because it has flowers of its own ready to open up. I hope. I hope I get to see them open up. But we have this really unattractive clump of straw flowers on the top. Basically, I guess the straw flowers just for appeal. Many plant owners should only expect a cactus to bloom you know, two to three years and typically they only bloom in the desert after heavy rains, which don't happen very often. This one reminded me of like the Epcot ball at Disney. It gave me a little bit more problems um, with things falling in between. So I kind of had to wiggle this one apart and cut the glue at the bottom of the flower and it did just end up coming off pretty easily. My best tip for this is just be gentle, work with it. I'm showing you a video that's sped up quite a bit, so I'm moving even slower than this and uh, just be patient and if you pull these up don't worry it'll grow back it's okay it's actually way better to get the glue clump off <laughs> comment down below if you think they should stop gluing these to all the cactus babies and also stop spray painting the other ones Ta -da! and as you can tell they just look better without it there is some residual dye that will eventually grow out or wash off with misting if it happens to get it or if I put them outside when it rains, when it's warmer. They look so much better! Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already. I would love to have you here on my channel and I will see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!